Hi, my name is Monica Burns. I'm an EdTech and Curriculum Consultant, founder of ClassTechTips.com, and a webinar host for Simple K-12. I want to share with you another way to make newsletters um, for your class or for students to make newsletters to share about things that are happening in their school, and that's using Microsoft Word and the Microsoft Word templates tool. So I'm already in my Microsoft Word. I've hit File and New from Template, and this box pops up, and this might look a little different depending on your version of Word. This box might pop up for you automatically if you are opening Word for the first time today, but I can go ahead and search for templates if I wanted to, but right here, um, right near the top of the list is my newsletter. So I can double click on this and it'll take my Word document and transform it into a newsletter. So here you have the opportunity and we'll scroll down. You'll see it gives me two pages um, for a newsletter um, that your students can create or you can create to share with families. And so you might be looking at this and saying, hmm, you know, I really love this color, but maybe I want to change something, you have the opportunity to change um, different shapes, right? You have the option here. I just clicked on it um, to go to format shape and I can change the color if I want it to match with um, school logo or something like that. You can go ahead and click on the newsletter title here. We're going to place this with June updates and I can say, hmm, I'm not a lover of Times Roman numeral as a font. Uh, maybe I want to scroll through, find something a little bit more lighthearted, a little bit more fun. Maybe this marker felt, um, and maybe I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so it really fills up, and I can even put it so it's centered. So you can use the templates as they are, or you can make lots of options. Um, you can use lots of different options to customize it. We might decide we don't want a volume one or issue one, so we can click on this. Um, and we can just get rid of it by clicking delete. Um, we can pull out a quote or we can put in some contact information. It's really up to you how true you wanna to stay to the individual um, templates as you are working um, to create your own newsletter. So this will set you up with um, headings, with captions, places to insert and replace your own pictures. Again, really up to you and what you wanna do. You might say, you know what, this is set up for a mailer. We're not gonna worry about mailing. I'm gonna just fill this in with more information or a nice big picture as part of the newsletter. So if you're creating newsletters yourself to send home to families, the Microsoft Word template um, for newsletters can be really useful. If you want students to create their own newsletters, you can set them loose with this, um, let them know that they can customize to fit the mood and tone of the message they're trying to get across.